Chip Kitties. How are y'all? Good. 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 I decided to stay in virtual school because I felt like ATI Virtual Middle School was just a, such a better middle school experience for me than if I were to do it in public school. My typical school day is waking up in the morning. I would make breakfast, and then I would just hang out, maybe read a book. I would join school at 9.30. I would have my core course for an hour. So that's either humanities, science, or math. Go ahead and put them in. It seems like the, the hotter, the red one, which is in the hot water, is going up much faster. I would have a break and coaching cohort. Coaching cohort is a time where I meet with my coach and the other students that have the same coach as me and we bond, we just talk about whatever we want or we play games. Sometimes we work on like a vision board or something that we started. After that, we have work cycle, so that's one of the structured block times. During work cycle, I would work on just any work. It could be a science experiment, which is always really fun. Working on my values and my hobbies for the thought and industry course, or just anything really that I need to work on is structured for that time. Sometimes I have a question about, about an assignment or something. I can easily reach out to my teacher or my coach through Teams or just ask them when they can meet with me. If I have a question about what does this mean or how can I fix this um, or just feedback, they will always be there for you. After work block, there is an hour of uh, lunch. I would typically eat lunch with my parents. Sometimes I would go out on a short walk. I would get back onto school and we would have another structured block of work time. They talked about language. Where would you put language on here? That math is a type of language. Reasoning. Reasoning. Yeah. Yeah. Reasoning. yeah. Okay, so let's put language. Sometimes the teachers would lead a small lesson connected to their subject. We would have student enrichment for the last hour of school, which is basically enriching your lives and things that you love doing or want to do. During this enrichment time, I really like reading my book or playing piano or going outside to the backyard to play soccer with my little brother. I'm working on my picture book for young children that I started a few summers ago. The first scene of the book, um, the main character is going to the store to get some things and she's waving goodbye to her mom. This would be the background. So it's gonna be a black and white photo. I got this inspiration from this author named Mo Willems. He takes pictures of actual backgrounds and then draws the props and the characters on his own and puts them into the background. I took pictures of settings that I liked that worked with the story and put it together like that. On Wednesdays, there's community time and that's when I'm able to pursue my passion specifically for one thing or start an internship or volunteer somewhere. What I'm doing is I'm interning at the local Guidepost Montessori School. Basically what I'm doing is I'm observing and just getting the overall experience of being a Guidepost Montessori guide and just being around the students. So that is typical school day.